Hey guys, it's Sherry here. If you're new to my channel, welcome. I am a new expat here in Singapore and I moved here for my job from Canada. I am starving, so let's go order the food. So I just ordered all the food. Let me walk you through what I got. I got a sweet chili fish burger. So this is not your usual fish filet which actually is my favorite burger, but it looks like this. You have a deep fried fish patty here and some cabbage coleslaw. The bun is your usual soft, cushiony McDonald's bun. I cannot go to McDonald's and not get fries, which is my favorite part. For the drink, instead of getting Coke or anything, I got a Milo because I'm in Asia and that's what you gotta do. And I love Milo and I never have it, so that's my excuse. And then here I have a very fast melting soft serve. This is the Yin Yang coffee milk tea soft serve. I feel like I should probably start with this, but I really want to just take a look at this first. Huh. Mm. This is actually really good. So at first, you can't really taste anything. Honestly, it tastes a lot like Yin Yang. I, well, I shouldn't be surprised because that's the name of it. But Mmm, I like it. It's on the sweet side for sure, but if you're gonna eat ice cream, it better be sweet. All right, are you guys ready for a big bite? Oh. Mm. I wish you guys could hear how crunchy this is. It's so crunchy. And the fish is actually not oily, usually. Anything fried would be like drenched in oil and the bun would be soggy, but the sweet chili sauce actually really balances the kind of fried fish, but oh god. Honestly, it's even crunchier than like Popeyes or KFC chicken. Mm. All right, before the ice cream completely melts, which it is already, I'm gonna try the ultimate test. McDonald's fries and McFlurries or vanilla ice cream is thebomb.com. Let's see if this works as well. I think the milk tea taste is too strong, so I'd stick to a McFlurry if I were you guys. So interesting story about this video, I actually tried to film it three times. So I was on Instagram at like 1am right before I was about to sleep. The night before I had to go on a work trip to Indonesia, Jakarta, I saw the news about McDonald's launching this ice cream. Checked online, saw that Changi Airport had a 24 hour McDonald's. <sighs> Alright guys, it is literally <laughs> 1 in the morning right now and I need to wake up very early to catch a flight tomorrow. I'm searching up the McDonald's phone number. My flight is a morning flight, so I don't even know if they can serve lunch food. And we are calling. Are they even gonna pick up? <sighs> no, please pick. <sighs> Honestly, if no one picks up, I'm going to call all the McDonald's at the terminals and I will just take a cab to whatever terminal, film the video and then go to the terminal I need to. I'm gonna try terminal four because I've been to that one a few times and I know the lighting is great. This is so sad. Terminal four. Please pick up. Uh, since no one is picking up, then I guess tomorrow I will just go to the airport really early and find out. Hello guys, it is 6 a.m. right now and I am going to try calling one more time and see how that goes. Hi, I was just calling. Oh no, is there any chance that you guys are able to serve it earlier, like in the morning? Calling Terminal 4 right now. Oh my gosh, thank you so, so, so much. See you at 8 then. Okay, bye. Okay, bye. Oh my god, okay. I ended up not being able to film the video, but that's okay. Timing was really tight anyway. And I, I am still so thankful for the Terminal 4 McDonald's. They are so nice. Hopefully, I'll be able to film it when I come back from my work trip. Yeah, all right, time to run to the 
to the right terminal and to check in my bag. <laughs> And then last night I flew back from Jakarta. It was super late and then I was at Terminal 2 once again. I went to Terminal 4 and saw the same guy. He was super nice again. But then he was like, we don't have the dessert kiosk at this McDonald's. I was like about to rip my hair out. Then he told me there's a McDonald's 10 minutes away that has it. So the Terminal 4 McDonald's people helped me kindly call the McDonald's that's 10 minutes away to ask and make sure that what I want is there. And then they said they just closed the soft serve machine for the day. <laughs> Why? So today I'm here having this burger, which is tasting especially nice because I am finally getting my hands on it. Mm -hmm. Maybe this is the ultimate test. I feel like this is a terrible mistake. If you guys enjoyed this video, remember to subscribe. I'm going to try to film more videos about just cool things in Singapore. So if there's anything you think I should check out, leave a comment down below. I'll tell you guys next time. Bye!